Windows 11 is the next client operating system and includes features that organizations should know. Windows 11 is built on the same foundation as Windows 10. If you use Windows 10, then Windows 11 is a natural transition. It's an update to what you know and what you're familiar with. It offers innovations focused on enhancing end-user productivity and is designed to support today's hybrid work environment. Your investments in update and device management are carried forward. For example, many of the same apps and tools can be used in Windows 11. Many of the same security settings and policies can be applied to Windows 11 devices, including PCs. You can use Windows Autopilot with a zero-touch deployment to enroll your Windows devices in Microsoft Endpoint Manager. You can also use newer features, such as Azure Virtual Desktop and Windows 365 on your Windows 11 devices. This video is all about how to update Windows 11 in your PC, even if you're using older hardware without any concerns to the hardware recommendations. Without any ado, let's start the video. First of all, the user has to update the Windows operating system from the Windows Update settings. For that user has to navigate to the Start menu. Then search for Windows Update Settings. Windows Update Wizard will open. If your computer or laptop is compatible with the hardware recommendations for Windows 11, you will be able to update operating system without any error, and this is correct method to upgrade the operating system, as per Microsoft's recommendations. However, this is the simple process and anyone easily can perform the steps without any additional training. This video is made for the users whose hardware is not compatible with Windows 11 recommendations. If your hardware is not compatible, you will have an error message while you are trying to update the operating system. That the error will be, this PC doesn't currently meet the minimum system requirements to run Windows 11. As you can see on my PC screen right now. However, Microsoft devolved an application to check the system hardware health and compatibility for Windows 11 upgrades. Click on Get PC Health Check to download the app. Once user clicks, it will redirect to Download Center. Click on Download, then install the software. Moreover, I have already downloaded and installed the software. Let's minimize this and open the software by searching from the Start menu. Once the application open, click on Check Now button for further process. A pop-up window open. There you will have all the compatibly comments from the Microsoft for Windows 11 upgradation. As you can see here also it's giving clear message that the MyPC hardware not suitable to install Windows 11 upgradation. But I have committed with you guys in the beginning of this video that I will install the Windows 11 operating system on my PC. Even my hardware is incompatible. Let's close this all tabs and follow me for the upgradation. Let's download the Windows 11 operating system. To do that open any web browser and paste the link which is also given in the description. Once user clicks on the link, it will redirect to Microsoft Windows 11 Download Center. Scroll down and download the Windows 11 installation media software by clicking on download button. Once user clicks on download, media creation tool w11.exe file will start downloading. Wait till it's completely download and then dual click on it to start the installation. Once user clicks on the exe file, the Windows 11 Setup Wizard will open. It will take a while to getting ready for the download of Windows 11 operating system. To continue, accept the application notices and license terms by clicking on Accept button. If user wishes to read the terms and condition before installation, scroll down and read it. Personally I will also recommend to read and understand the terms and conditions for every software or even if you're installing any application in the mobile phone. However, not going to deeper in that topic, let's continue our original scope of this video. Once user clicks on accept, it will take while to get ready for the next step. Here select your preferable language and edition. 
as of now Windows 11 have a single edition, so no need to change anything here. Let's continue by clicking on Next. This step to choose file type, and the location of the file. Here user will have two options either directly download the operating system in a USB flash drive, as bootable drive, and make sure it needs to be at least 8 GB. Or else, user can download ISO file of the operating system. However I will be going with second option, and I will recommend to my viewers also to use the second option, and click on next. Once user clicks on next, a window will open to select preferable location where user wants to save the downloading. Select the location, and click on save. It will take a while to start the downloading. As you can see on the screen, that the Windows 11 OS is started downloading. It will take time to download, upon your internet speed. Meanwhile user can minimize this windows, and proceed with others. Let me forward the video for further process. After the downloading, it will verify your downloaded files. And then it will create Windows 11 media files. Once everything is done successfully, you no needs to burn the ISO file to a DVD. Just click on finish, for further process. Once user clicks on finish, setup is cleaning up before it closes the window. This process may take a few minutes. Let's close all the background application. And go to the same location where you have saved the ISO file of the Windows 11 operating system. Open the ISO file folder by dual clicking on it. Here user will have Windows 11 operating system setup file. Right click on the setup file, and select run as administrator. It will start preparing installation. Windows 11 installer wizard will open. Click on, change how setup download updates. Make sure you have select the first option that is download updates, Drivers and optional feature, which is also recommended from Microsoft, and click on Next. It will take a moment to check the updates. The updates are installed, but Windows 11 setup needs to restart for them to work. After it restart, we'll keep going from you left off. At this stage, it will check again the hardware compatibility of your PC. As per your PC hardware configuration it will proceed further, after the checking. Or, it might be not proceed further, due to hardware compatibilities issue. As you can see on my screen, again it's unable to proceed further, due to the same hardware compatibilities issue. However, we should not disappoint at this point, and do not lose your hope. I have other two more method, where we can easily update the operating system even the hardware is not compatible with the Windows 11 hardware recommendations from Microsoft, that I will cover in the next videos. The link of the videos is available in the description. As of now let's close this window by clicking on cancel. Hope you understood how we can try to update the Windows 11 operating system, even your hardware is not compatible. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like and share our channel. And please give us your valuable suggestions and comments, in order to improve our quality of work. Thank you, see you soon.